So today we're going to put some underglow um, lighting on my 2014 Easy Go. So the kit that I got here is, uh, I guess this is the part number, um, X Bright Car Underglow. Um, comes with a remote, two three foot and two four foot strips, uh, peel and stick. They're suggesting that you use zip ties, and they include zip ties. So basically you got your LED strip here, peel off that, got the remote, pretty much your red, green, blue, a quick and simple guide. Like I said, this is, mo is this for a car. So the wiring is going to be a little long for a golf cart. Came with zip ties, some smaller ones. I bought a package of larger ones. It also came with a cigarette or power adapter in case you plug, want to plug it in that way to your car. And then an extension cable to maybe reach that back one or whatever one's farther away. So I've already taken off the wheel on the golf cart. Get in here. What you're gonna want to do is, I pulled out the inner fender. Goes from like right here down to here, and then clean the frame. I had to wipe this down, wash it, and then I just attached the the LED strip to the frame, and then cut these zip ties off. Now. I think for the back one, I'm going to install it right there, which is like the floor. Maybe this is a better shot. It's like the floor. I need to clean this up still. Um, the floor for where the bags used to go. So that way I can drill holes in it and zip tie the LED strip up along with the tape after I get this cleaned. So I'm gonna get this cleaned and then cut these zip ties and I'll bring you back in and show you what I got but basically the connectors are gonna come over and this box right here it senses like stereo or whatever and I guess that the lights will change to the bead or whatever um, and then this bundle of wires right here that I got zip tied up has the ends on it you can see right here and you just I'm just gonna cut the zip tie run the, the ends to wherever I need them and then zip tie it all up so I'll bring you back in when I got it all done all right so you can see how I zip tied drill these holes then zip tied it plus it's double sided tape you know you can see the zip ties along the frame and then on the bottom one it just goes all the way across and we just run zip ties drill holes um, got the inner fender well back in bought a couple of push clips it's all tidy and neat up here and it comes with a remote so we're ready to uh, put the wheel back on and put the inner fender back on the other side and we're done